What's up, fuckers? <clears throat> uh, today's video title is uh, uh, Meta Tags. Why Meta Tags? Because uh, it's literally illegal at the moment to be outside after 9 p.m., motherfucker. And uh, it might be after 9 p.m. It might be before 9 p.m. Because it's fucking winter. There's a pandemic going on. And I just had a salami cheese bread. And with my beer in my right hand. Um, and... Uh, a clear, bright, cold, full moon, man. <clears throat> and uh, there's literally a 500 euro fine if you're outside in that time range. And uh, maybe it's an act I'm putting on that it's after 9 p.m. Or maybe it's really before 9 p.m. You never know. All I know is uh, police are patrolling. It's literally illegal to be outside. And this shit is scary, man. Like, I feel almost like a refugee, you know? I'd say if shots were fired, it wouldn't be... A legal to leave the house ever I'd say this is what it feels like this is what it feels like <laughs> referencing a Nine Inch Nails song of course to be outside um, today I'm not filming from the uh, selfie cam basically I'm filming from the normal cam how about I'd say it's so fucking dark it's actually not quite bright everywhere you can see like 100 meters ahead but the shitty night cam I mean you see barely any lights but I can distinguish every fucking house from here man yeah uh, the inner terror you know like I have a constant dread and fear that something might go wrong and then I tend to do stuff that is not completely legal this gives me an extra adrenaline rush and uh, yeah, puts me on edge and gives me more anxiety. But the good thing is, I'm out here, holy shit, I'm out here on the field. There are literally, literally two horses standing around. I'm getting really fucking paranoid. two horses out there standing there man if these fuckers scream I'm fucking screwed you hear that metal man this is the sound of doom yo holy shit I'm getting post apocalyptic vibes sneaking around an old small village Avoiding and escaping police, but if you re replace the police with zombies or terrorists, uh, yeah, you kind of have the same fear and dread. And especially as a first world citizen, uh, there are things that hurt me, there are things that really hurt me. And uh, if you step in my fucking wallet, things become real. And maybe a rich white person has like a higher tolerance for catching a bullet, maybe. But less if you like attack his savings or his money bank account. Motherfucker. Why aren't these fuckers sleeping? Like, 
Oh nice, there is like this muddy path I walked one week ago, or oh, now this week, and it was so fucking muddy that I slipped everywhere. Now my soles of, the sh of my shoes are so fucking thin that the mud is literally stabbing me in the foot right now. Very uncomfortable. Oh. I thought about uh, talking a lot about my personal crap here and there. But uh, what about like music criti critics and generally criticizing music releases and whatnot? I thought about doing this kind of. Now I'm going, this is basically the same route I took like two weeks ago, where it also was kind of faintly raining, but not really. Blauwitch Project 59. This time it gets real. Uh, yeah. Uh, maybe you, the viewer or listener, is bonding with me right now. We're on an emotional trip. You feel like I care about you. We're, we're bonding. Very emotional. Very intimate. <laughs> no, just kidding. Uh, yeah, man. But this is kind of like when somebody screams, you know, you automatically associate anger with, with this person. But maybe the person is deaf. This is like the normal talking volume referencing Twin Peaks here. And if somebody talks like normal, maybe they're bored. Like a lot of it is like tonal timber, you know, sound timber stuff. And uh, especially today, man. And uh, yeah, now I don't have a wind pop, pop, pop blocker and I know the microphone, the very faint and soft wind hitting the microphone is very loud, which takes away this ASMR feel. Not to mention that every big corporate fucker is selling smartphones between 100 and 2000 euros and still these fuckers, all the fuckers, use five cent microphones. They did it 10 years ago, they will do it in 10 years later on. Why? Because really nobody listens. And I don't mean this in a social commentary way. Well, not completely. Oh, nice. Here's like the electric fence. And here you can see like electricity. Can you see it? Oh yeah. Where is it? What the fuck? Oh. There we have it. Now you can see it. Is this a short? I'd say this is a short. Fuck, I can't. Can I turn on the lights? Oh shit, yeah, I can turn on the lights. This will give my. Oh fuck, my fingers are too. I tried with my tongue. Hmm? Motherfucking display isn't even recognizing my tongue. Nah, no, I think this is because the the video software is programmed. So I can either record with light or record without light. And I can't switch between those two, I suppose. Or the display is so cold. Yeah, like I mentioned before. Holy shit man, the man has taken care of me. Uh, now where was I? Yeah, here's a bit oh, blah blah. And the fuck, we're reaching the point. Well, I'm reaching the point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm reaching the point. Okay, stop fucking referencing Nine Inch Nails. We get it. You, you, you like them. No. Uh, what was I saying? Yeah. Constant dread. only thing scarier than loud sounds is pure you know quietness and I don't mean this in a boo jump scare kind of sense it's like seriously sometimes 
have a small tinnitus. I hear a little bit of faint white noise or pink noise. I don't, I don't know. But uh, sometimes it gets so fucking quiet. The quiet man. Seriously. And I don't even have to visit one of those quiet chambers to know. Constant fear and dread is ahead if it's so fucking silent. Because right now, it's like I'm fucking screaming. Everything is quiet around me. I'm the loudest object in the fucking area. Every footstep, man, gives my fucking location away. They're fucking coming, man. Oh. I suppose um, this isn't a short back there, the electric fence. I suppose that's typical. Cool. Fuck, that was one of the horses, man. One of these fuckers trampled. Like, imagine you're hitting that sweet ass horse posse. You know, you know what I'm saying, man. You know it. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> Oh, nice, finally the fingers get warm so I can move them. And uh, yeah, I did a little bit of writing, you know. One fifth of the school project is finished. I kind of intended to finish the text and the pictures, but I somewhat got stuck. I seriously wish I would have started three months ago. But uh, I thought about this when I took a shit. Like this is part of the human experience. If you start a project proper in time, you are not human, you know? If you start way too late, this is the casual, normal human course that you have to take. Oh yeah, by the way, I kind of had uh, like 10 caffeinated beverages today and I kind of expected a hard rush. I'm saying I'm not saying this like uh, yeah I don't feel nothing man like I'm the strong guy here but uh yeah sometimes caffeine hits hard and sometimes it doesn't it might be also the fact that I had some very greasy food which slows down digestion in general and uh, by the way notice how I'm sleep deprivated and I'm less my speech is less slurred I'm finding the proper words. I even have a bottle of beer right now in my hand. Like, I'm sharp. Sharp as a fucking nail, man. Because the constant dread and fear and the caffeine and the alcohol all combined with sleep deprivation and the fear of my money keep me fucking sharp, man. Yo. Uh, yeah. I also, uh, yo. See lights in the distance and they kind of flicker and then you think is this light shining at me okay stop it the fucking world now there's a main problem with paranoia it's like uh, you're giving self yourself the chance that you think that you are that important as a matter of fact you have to consider following uh, things into the equation number one uh, police these aren't Fucking light getting stronger. Holy fucking shit, man. <sighs> Fuck. Okay. Number one. Okay. Holy shit, man. Seriously, stop taking drugs. Like, I, I'm getting HPPD vibes. Um. Yeah, number one. Why is this light so fucking bright? This is even brighter than the fucking moon. And directly blinking into my fucking eyes. This is normal. Holy shit, man. I'm not joking around right now. What the fuck's up with that? Is this like an alarm system? Literally. Crouch 
running around right now. What the fuck is that? What the actual fuck is that, man? Am I being watched right now? Fuck. Should I turn around? What the fuck? What the fuck is that fucking light? The worst case, I have to pay 500 euros, but uh, it's kind of the chase and the hunt in general. I think this light is lighting around, like from left to right. This is a fucking watchtower. city turned dark yo what the fuck i'm gonna stop recording now